Carrie, it's Jessica. Welcome back to the Mommy Archives. Today I'm super excited to be sharing a review of my experience with the app Simple Prints. And what Simple Prints is, is an app that makes it super easy to create a photo book using your iPhone photos. And so in this box here, I have a photo book that I myself created using this Simple Prints app. And my experience with the app was really positive. I found it really, really easy to work with, simple layout, simple concept, but the result I think is really beautiful. And I'm just so impressed with how the product turned out. And so here is the book. And I decided to make a book capturing Kennedy's first steps. And so this book is filled with pictures of the day that Kennedy learned to walk. And it was such a special day for us. And I, like I'm sure many moms and dads out there, have a ridiculous number of photos of my kid on my phone. But it's sad to me because they're really just sitting on my phone and they're not being looked at very often and they're not being appreciated. They're just sitting there taking up space essentially and so I love the idea of photo books and being able to take those memories and turn it into something tangible that you can hold and show people and put on display and like I said capturing her first steps in this little book I just think it was a really cute idea I mean it's my idea so obviously I liked it but I'm really pleased with how it turns out so you can add text and you can do like a little dedication on the front I just decided to put the day because um, Caleb and I know the meaning behind it and we can talk to Kennedy about that day and also I just never wanted to forget the day that she learned how to walk. Um, yeah, I just, while it was fresh in my memory, um, I wanted to make sure to include it in the book so that we always remember the day and so it starts off with just our day at the pumpkin patch because she did learn how to walk at a pumpkin patch in October before Halloween. And yeah, we just went and we had lunch there and she was chowing down on some corn. And then by the end of it, she is walking. And that's how we ended our trip there. Literally, that was one of the last things we did at the pumpkin patch there was take footage of her learning to walk. And so there we have it, her first steps in print and so I just think that is really really special. I'll kind of flip through and show you some other pictures. Of course she liked to walk on daddy's shoulders and this is before she started walking on her own. Um, she started by holding our hands and she literally just took off at the pumpkin patch and this book is just so special to me now because I mean we had such a great time as a family and it just really helps remember this special day with our beautiful little girl and when she took her first steps and it was just such a momentous occasion. Now as you saw me flipping through you probably noticed that I didn't use any text in the book. I chose not to. I just kind of wanted it to be a book where we could, you know, remember the memories and we could show it to Kennedy later and talk to her about what was happening. I didn't necessarily want captions on each photo saying what was going on because I mean, first of all, they're pretty self-explanatory, but I just, like I said at the beginning of the video, I just wanted to have the date on there so we always remember the day it happened. But um, I really just wanted it to be a book where we could show the pictures to Kennedy and talk to her about it without a lot of words. I just wanted the photos. Look at how cute that baby is. Oh my goodness. I just, I think the quality of this is so great. The turnaround is really, really quick too. I think it took about a week to get into my hands. And for me, considering, you know, that had to go from, you know, having nothing, going from scratch to having a finished, beautiful product like this. It's so a hardcover, is done really, really well. I think a week turnaround to get it in my hands is phenomenal. I also think the photo quality is really great. Any darkness that you see in photos or imperfections, let me tell you, is not a reflection of the printing. It is a reflection of the photographer. <laughs> so don't be too harsh of a judge. I was taking photos, Caleb was taking photos, my parents are taking photos, and so yeah, we got a big conglomeration of things in here that I had acquired on my phone. And so we're not, we're none of us are professional photographers. So considering that, I think, you know, the book just turned out really beautifully, even though we're amateurs for sure. Now this isn't necessarily a tutorial, so I don't want to spend a ton of time showing you the app and how to create photos, but I, there are some features in the app that I wanted to show you. So when I open the app, this is what I see. The app is super simple to use, very streamlined. If I want to create a new album, I just very easily open that up and I can do photos for my camera roll, Facebook, Instagram, all that good stuff. And so let's just grab a bunch of photos off of my camera roll just to show you guys an example. It's very easy to move photos around. You just hold and scroll. As you can see, it saved other albums that I've created. 
And so this is the one that I printed out. This is another one that's kind of a work in progress. I can add a caption so that the book has a title, and so we'll just call this Kennedy's First Year. And then we've got a title on the photo book. You can do the same thing here. As you can see, I have captions here. It's very easy if you want to make it like a grid style or collage style. You can edit the page and then just choose the format you like. So let's just do something like that. And then you just click on the bank spaces. We're going to use photos that I've added, but you can add new photos. And I'm just going to grab some random photos to show you guys how it works. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time um, being picky, but it's very easy to do that. You can zoom in if you want to can rotate the photo. If you want to remove the photo, you can. And so it's all very, very simple to use. It literally takes minutes to put a photo book together. You can add a ton of photos at once. Also under the settings, there's a place where you can get a little tutorial. There's frequently asked questions. There's this little link where you can request photos from friends and they'll just message your friends for you. And you know, you can request that they send you pictures for the book. There's ways to get discounts, and so I just think this is a really easy to use, very streamlined app, and the product that turns out is really beautiful and high quality. Of course, Father's Day is right around the corner, and men are so difficult to shop for. Moms out there, I'm sure you feel me on this. When you're trying to shop for Father's Day, you're like, what do I get my husband? But I think Going with a photo book like this is a really sweet idea, especially if you have a lot of pictures of your children or child and their daddy and you can make this book for him and he has like a, a daddy and me type book. I just think that's really sweet. Or pictures of the whole entire family. Of course, you know, I've decided to choose a specific day to make a book out of and so you can get really creative with it and put all those photos that are just taking up memory in your iPhone into a form that is tangible and beautiful and is just a quality, quality product. And so I can't recommend Simple Prints enough. The price for a hardcover book is $29.99 if I remember correctly, but I do have a $15 referral code. So if you'd like to get $15 off of your photo book purchase, that'll make it $14.99. It's a terrific deal. Um, I will definitely leave that code for you linked down below. This app is currently only available on iPhones, but I know they are trying to come up with an Android version of it. So if you don't have an iPhone, you can use the app. The app is free to download. And so, like I said, it's really easy just to go on there and create your albums. And I think the price you'll pay for it, especially with the $15 referral discount, uh, it's definitely worth it for the quality product you get. Once again, I was just so excited to share this product with you guys. I was so pleased with my experience and how my photo book turned out. Thank you guys for watching and also thank you to Simple Prints for sponsoring this video. I appreciate it so much. Sponsored videos allow me to share products and services that I love with you guys. I would never endorse or get paid by a company for a product I didn't believe in and wouldn't purchase with my own money and so I will definitely be using the Simple Prints app again in the future to purchase more photo books. I think they make terrific gifts, like I said, and so I will definitely be reusing this app in the future. I'm sure if you use Simple Prints in the future to make a photo book for yourself or a loved one that your experience will be just as positive as mine was. And if this video is helpful to you or if you enjoyed it, I would love if you gave this video a thumbs up. And if you're new to the Mommy Archives and want to see more from me in the future, just be sure to click that subscribe button down below. I post new videos every single week here on YouTube. Well, once again, thank you guys so very much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.